Hello, my name is Ikele Morrison. You are welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Serial Engineer channel. In case you are new in this YouTube channel, please ensure you subscribe. And there's more other video I'm going to upload of which will teach you about structural engineering and other things in designing. So ensure you subscribe. Let's go to the business of the day. How to estimate the quantity of cement in a concrete per cubic? We have the, I want to introduce two to you. I want to teach you two of them. So the two I'm going to teach you is ritual one. This ritual one three six I'm going to teach you now. Please pay proper attention. For instance, now at the ritual one two four, we have six point four. of colon to control or to design whether to design or anything i want to check numbers meters and everything i said first of all they give you the colon size which is the length to be 10 meter the breadth to be one meter sorry the you are given a colon box to control you want, you want to know the numbers meters you enter the length one meter the breadth one meter and the height is five meter what you have to do now is length times breadth times height so 1 times 5 is equal to 1 times 0 0.5 which is equal to 0 0.5 and i have six number of color inside the structure inside the building six number of color so 0 0.5 times 6 i have 3 so 3 times 4 6.4 which is per cubic 0 0.6 times 4 which is per cubic is equal to 19 bars of cement to be used for that six column base so 19 bars of cement of what your cement is to be used but at the ratio of 136 136 we have 4.5 per cubic we also applicable to this other formula which is length times breadth times height which is equals to 3 so what you have to do now is 1 times 1 is equals to 1 times 0 0.5 is equals to 0 0.5 times 6 you have 3 so 3 times 4.5, you have 13 bars of cement to be used for 6 number of color. So 13 bars and half. In this 13.5, which is 13 bars and half, you are going to be used. There is no way you will miss or over miss. At least you have to work to be happy. So at every missing ratio, at every missing ratio of this, we have 1.6, something like this. So this one for something like this, and if you divide that at the ratio of one, three, six, half bag of cement, half bag of cement, sand, and stone. So six bucket of stone, half bag. So let me teach you another formula of which will be very easier for you to do, to be used at one. 6 at 136 same thing applicable you have the the length on meter height 2.5 so what i have to do now is what i have to do now is 1 times 1 times 0 0.5 divide by 10 how come about this 10 this plus this 4 this plus this 4 plus 6 is equals to 10 this is 10 at the standard missing ratio we have another derivation which is 0 0.03 Hope you are following. So, 1 times 1 is equal to 1 times 2 equals to 0 0.5. 0 0.5. 0 0.5. Divide by 10. You have equals to 0 0.05. 0 0.05 divided by 0 0.03. You have 1.666. Approximately. 1.7 so 
this 1.7 which is one bag and more than half bag of cement one bag of cement and more than half bag of cement so if you times this now 1.7 1.7 times 6 1.7 times 6 you are having approximately what which is equal to you are having about 10.2 10.2 So this 10.2 you are having So you are having 10.2 10, 10 bars of what? Of cement 2 bars of cement So what is the difference at the limiting ratio of using 13 point Five and ten point two. Is there any more different? The difference is just three bars. So by the time you make it of this formula, you know the number of cement you are going to use per fifty kg. So each of the cement will be given to you at a bag. It might be fifty kg. Kg, depending on your country, fifty kg of what of cement, depending on your country. Please follow this step very properly. So, in case you are new for this channel, please ensure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now, if you want to see you in my next video, I'll be very happy. Thank you. Ensure you subscribe. Bye. Okay, 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 The base you are seeing over there, the length and the breadth, the height is everything. So the length is 1.0 meter, the breadth is 1.0 meter, the height is 0 0.5 meter. And you can see how they are pouring the concrete on the base. Before the concrete is being cast in such a way, it was properly blinded with a thickness of 15 millimeter. 50 millimeter approximately 2 inches you can see how he's running the concrete and he has already there is a poke over the around that place so they want to poke the concrete is now you can see how they are poking it not to avoid every boy, everything that is cut food either who or boy on it they are removing it by what to put vibration they are vibrating it so that it settles down with the tree. Why did they poke? Poke it out of the tree. 